Hey, it's Chris with Mac Media TV, and uh, today I'm excited to have uh, Dr. Kyle Rhodes from the Lake Travis Eye and Laser Center in Lakeway, Texas, and we're talking about um, laser cataract surgery, um, something that's newer um, in the field, and I wanted to bring Dr. Rhodes on to educate us a little bit about um, what it is and what to look for. Dr. Rhodes, how are you? I'm, I'm excellent. Thanks for having me on today. Hey, thanks for taking the time out of your busy day um, to, to spend a little bit of it with us here and give us a little education. Let's start with the basics. Um, for me in particular, what are cataracts? Cataracts are where the normally clear lens inside the eye becomes cloudy over time. Uh, you can think of it as like a cloudy lens in a camera. Okay, so as it gets cloudier, we start to lose clarity and some vision. That's great. Um, okay, so then it, it may seem self-explanatory, explanatory, but what is um, laser cataract surgery? Sure. So laser cataract surgery is where we use the femtosecond laser to make all of the uh, surgical incisions. Uh, basically, brilliant engineers revamped the LASIK laser uh, and redesigned it for intraocular use so we can use the laser for a surgery inside the eye like cataract surgery. Uh, the reason it's so exciting to us eye surgeons are that it's increased the precision and accuracy of cataract surgery to levels we've never we've never experienced. Uh, it has basically made the entire procedure a bladeless, uh, a bladeless, blade free, however you want to refer to it, uh, surgery, just like LASIK. So it is just like LASIK. Um, how long is the procedure? Um I know that you, everybody's different, but how long would something like that normally take? Average time is probably around 10 to 12 minutes. Wow. No kidding. <laughs> That's amazing technology. Um, so help us out a little bit. I know that does, does every um, ophthalmologist, every eye doctor offer this type of surgery? No. Currently, uh, it, it's not that common but it's uh, kind of spreading like wildfire through uh, ophthalmology. Is it? Okay. So what do we need to look for then uh, if we're looking for um, dipping our toe in the water and, and looking to find a good uh, eye doctor that, that gives, that is a good LASIK um, and cataract surgeon? Sure. First, and, and uh, always most important is the reputation. Uh, and in today's world, the best way to, to find out about a doctor is online. Uh, and, and dig. So look for several different sites. Try to dig around and look for uh, authenticated patient reviews. And try to find uh, doctors or websites that have lots of reviews so you can really trust lots of real patients and not just three or four different reviews. Usually you'll find the truth if you can find a website with hundreds of reviews. Uh, and, and secondly is technology. Uh, does the surgeon have access to a laser for laser cataract surgery? Uh, and same thing for LASIK. Do they have access to a LASIK laser? Uh, also, does the surgeon use different types of lens implants? Uh, some surgeons will only use one company or one type of lens implant for every, uh, every patient. Uh, try to find a surgeon that is advanced enough that they'll use uh, different types of lenses and match the lenses uh, to you. Great. Thanks. That's great advice. Now, if somebody uh, was to come to you, uh, they found you online and called and made an appointment. What makes you you different than everybody else out there? What makes you unique? Sure. Well, what I'm most proud of at our clinic is the customer service. I think we provide uh, unmatched customer service. And I, I, I know it's it's easier said than done, but we, we do treat people with respect. We treat you as a unique individual. Uh, for example, we, we normally always run on time. Um, I give you enough time to ask questions with uh, me, and I give us enough time where I can answer any question you have. Uh, for example, on your first visit, so for a cataract surgery consult, uh, you spend an hour with me. Uh, we first start by simply talking. I ask you questions about your lifestyle. Uh, what do you do? Do you work on the computer every day? Are you retired? Are you outside every day? Do you go to movies? Are you in restaurants reading menus? Uh, do you drive every day? Do you drive at night? Are you golfing nearly every day? Are you a tennis player? Um, you know, what are your goals after surgery? Do you want to be glasses free? Is that a huge deal for you? Or do you do you mind if you have to wear glasses after surgery? 
Uh, then second, I measure your eye. I use the latest technology to measure uh, every part of your eye from the front to the back and look for specific characteristics. And then third, uh, we sit down again and discuss what are the best options for you based on your answers to number one about your lifestyle and what I found out in number two when we measured your eye. Uh, so we try to match what type of surgery and what type of lens implant will deliver what you are looking for after the procedure. So kind of a it's customized service and we go over our goals and then after you measure our eye we see if our goals are compatible with what our eye, what your measurements come back with and see how close we can get. Uh, exactly, that's exactly right. Uh, basically I, I try to listen to what you do with your eyes on a daily basis and then I try to measure kind of the characteristics of your eye. What are the limitations? Do we have the capability to deliver what you're asking for? Uh, in some cases the answer is yes and <laughs> move on, and in some cases the answer is no. But it, I think it's important to try to figure out exactly what's best for you, not what, what's best for everyone in general. Well great, that, that's super refreshing. I, I appreciate that. I love the part about how, I, how we use our eyes. I, I think that that um, that right there sets you apart. So um, thank you for coming on. I'm going to put up the website for all those that are watching. Um, for more information, you can visit uh, Dr. Rhodes uh, online at uh, laketraviseyecenter.com. Or what's the phone number again, Dr. Rhodes? Can you give that to us? Sure, 512-263-9000. There you have it. Hey, thanks for watching um, and taking time out of your day to be with us. Dr. Rhodes, thanks for coming on and giving us a little education on our eyes today. We really appreciate it. Um, have a great day. Thanks for coming. Of course, anytime.